Next candidate I would like to introduce is Tom Foley. Good evening, everybody. I always like coming out to the second congressional district, and I want to thank everybody here. I don't know if you know it, but I won the second congressional district in 2010 by seven points, the highest margin of any Woo! congressional district. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, let me tell you a little bit about myself. I am not a career politician. Uh, I had nothing to do with creating the problems that we have here in Connecticut, and I'm proud to say that. I was a businessman for 25 years, uh, and then I went into government service twice. I served in Iraq, restructuring the economy there, and then I served in the State Department for two and a half years in Dublin, representing the United States government. I uh, describe myself first and foremost as a family man. I'm, uh, it's very important to me to be a good spouse. And uh, I'm also uh, a parent of, of two-year-old twins, which is a very demanding job. Um, and I, uh, I announced uh, on Wednesday that I was running for, for governor, and, and I wanted Reed and Grace to be there. They'd been asking me for weeks if they could be there. And uh, of course, they didn't cooperate, so I told the media, I said, you know, two-year-olds are a little bit like uh, the media in Connecticut. They don't always do what you want them to. Um, but listen, I, I, I describe myself as a Reagan, let me simplify this, I, I'm a Reagan Republican. I, uh, I believe in individual rights, limited government, I believe in the United States Constitution, and I believe in the Second Amendment of the United States Constitution. There is, it's very simple what needs to be done in Connecticut. We simply have to get control over spending. I uh, talked on Wednesday about holding spending flat for two years. After that, we can talk about reducing taxes. And we can reduce the uh, state sales tax. I'll work with the legislature to come up with tax reform that stops driving uh, taxpayers and businesses out of the state. We'll get rid of the business entity tax for uh, companies with fewer than 50 employees, for example. So there are a lot of good things we can do. As a businessman, I can go to my fellow uh, business uh, owners and uh, CEOs and ask them to give Connecticut a second look. Uh, and I think they will do that for me and I think they'll do it for a Republican governor who understands what they need. Finally, we need to fix the problems of our cities and we need real education reform. And just to give you an example of uh, education reform light that Governor Malloy put on here, why do you go to all the schools in Connecticut, many of which are great schools and performing well, and impose on them the we know best uh, uh, policies when you can just go to the schools that aren't performing well. So that's the way the government can be more limited, more targeted on problems. That's what we need to do in Connecticut. So thank you very much. I'm looking forward to the discussion.